YouTube changed my life. I thought that reaching my million subscriber milestone would be the perfect time to share my journey. But now that I am almost half a million, I realize that no amount of subscribers, views, likes can measure how much I am passionate about the platform. So here it goes. From thinking I was meant for a different path to pursuing what I love and finding purpose in it. With that purpose in mind and as I wore my heart on my sleeve, I found myself in my element, where I felt the happiest. It's as if the universe is conveying that I was destined for greater things as the stars aligned when I made it into my dream university, endured sleepless nights as a one-woman team, and created memories with new friends. <laughs> Who knew that posting silly little videos online would bring us to this day? Because <laughs> I didn't. So friends, this is my story. And I welcome you all to our new home. A lot of people ask who inspired me to start a YouTube channel. Uh, I was actually 11 years old when I discovered the YouTube space. My cousin Athena and I were scrolling through YouTube and I stumbled upon this random girl. And her name was Juicy Star 7 I believe her name is Blair. And it was a room tour video. And it was so crystal clear to me how I said to myself that all I want to have my own room as well and film it with my little camera. I was so young and I couldn't even grasp the concept of fame and money back then because YouTube was such a wholesome space back then. And actually a lot of people say that I come from a place of privilege which is why I have all the things that I have now. But truth be told, I came from a very simple family. Uh, my parents raised me. Uh, they were able to, you know, give us our needs like roof above our heads and food on our table but I had to work hard for all of my wants and I had to earn <laughs> for my wants. I started as an online seller then I would commute to VTR auditions after attending my morning classes during senior high school. I used my love for fashion and my passion for acting as my means of saving up for my first YouTube equipment. When I saved up for my own second-hand laptop and camera, I started my YouTube channel. I started making videos, maybe about fashion, my personal life, or even DIY room decor videos. And when I saved up, I tried to decorate a portion of the room wherein I share my siblings with. Wala akong sariling room noon. Karoon ko yung mga kapatid ko. Wala akong sariling kwarto. And I remember asking my relatives if they could share a portion of their storage room and I would turn it into my own filming corner. Imagine there are a lot of boxes and ang daming tambak surrounding me but I managed to make this tiny little corner aesthetically pleasing for my videos. And when I finally saved enough money for me to move out, I really tried my best to make these spaces into my own home. Which brings us here today. <laughs> and as I'm standing in front of you guys right now virtually, actually I'm not standing, I'm, <laughs> I'm kneeling down. <laughs> I could definitely say that with grit and a ton of hard work, you can conquer what seemed to be impossible. Sometimes I do think I sound cliche and I'm just a random girl from the internet, but look how a random girl from the internet impacted my life. Moving into the space is a gift to myself and I owe this to the young Ashley who dreamed and worked hard to be where she is right now. And it's a new chapter, <laughs> it's scary, but you know what they say, if your dreams do not scare you, they are not big enough yet. Hello everyone! Welcome to our new place! Uh, I'm gonna give you guys an apartment tour, an empty apartment tour. So, ito nakuha natin na condo is around, I think, 87 square meters. Yung previous condo natin mga nasa 47 lang yon. And this is a two-bedroom loft. 
So, this is what it looks like. Super bare ko lang siyang nakuha. And, uh, magpapagwapa tayo ng kitchen counter over here. And then, I'm not sure what I'm gonna put in here. Siguro mag dito na yung dining. Ayan, para maganda yung view ng, ano, pag kumakain ako ng breakfast, you know, stuff like that. So, yeah. And then, going over here, there's like an intercom. And then, the best part, ta-da! You guys, we made it! <laughs> so, I do think this is the highlight. Um, ito talaga yung parang nagpayes sa akin na, okay, mag-move ulit ako. Kasi <laughs> sobrang hassle na ng moving process. But I think this view and this type of condo made it all worth it. I do think so. Well, uh, ayun, um, I finally have a space for a TV, so I'm gonna buy my um, dream TV soon. And then, mahal dito yung, I don't know, mirror mat or sofa. So, yeah, most likely it will be my sala. Para pag I have friends over, ito yung view namin, guys. Oh, the view is so pretty. Anyway, and then going over on this side, you can come in with me. Meron parang, actually, ano talaga siya eh, parang maid's quarter. Pero, I'm gonna put my washing machine over here. And then, meron din siyang um, CR. Parang may toilet dito and may shower. Pero, I might just, you know, convert it into a storage room. Kasi, kaya talaga gusto ko mag-move. Parang hindi enough yung space na one bedroom sa akin. Hindi ko nga alam kung paano ko pinagkakasya yung mga gamit ko doon. Kasi ang dami talaga laging pinapadala sa amin ng mga stuff. Ayun. So, and then yun yung CR number one. And then this is the... This is what it looks like when it's closed. But this is the CR number two. Um, it's uh, the comfort room. Uh, parang powder room ng mga guests. Okay, now moving over on this side. We have the stairs. Super excited na ako. Like, I visualized the shots of everyday vlogs. Natin. So there's like a space over here where I can put like a shelf, more storage. And actually, I can put it here. It's a bit of a And then over here, we have the first bedroom. It looks like this. Yeah, it comes with an aircon. Now going over this room. So, ta-da! It's a beautiful view, guys. And I don't know yet if I'm gonna put like yung parang studio setup ko na backdrop para maganda yung lighting. Kasi sa baba parang sofa na lang yung kasha ko doon. And then I might put my dresser over here since I'm always gonna, you know, shoot videos as well. So, yeah. Medyo simple lang yung CR. Parang nothing much to it but it's pretty decent. At least meron na akong parang glass divider over here. So, ayun. That's about it for the empty apartment tour. Good morning, everyone. It is a new day. <laughs> Good morning. Okay, so today I will be getting my driver's license. Yay! Hi, salamat. <laughs> Hindi na ako magdadrive. <laughs> Hindi na siya magpapasundo. Yeah. Hindi na siya magpapahatid. No. She will take care of herself. Ah, 
Onion. Uh, isang pinakamaganda. Ano? Ako na magpapasundo. Uh -huh. Ako na magpapahati. <laughs> I know it took so long for me to get here and actually hindi ko pa alam kung makakapasa ako. Sana makapasa ako later. Let us manifest it. Actually, Papa, may clip ako. Ilalagay ko. Ano yan? May clip ako. Umiiyak ako haba. <laughs> Nagpa-park. Tomorrow na yung assessment ko. Tapos hindi ko na nabula. Nawa. Apat ako. May ego dito. <laughs> Nag-driving school na ako, pero hindi ko pa rin mag-gains. Hindi ako 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 ano na isa sa parang yung vlog ko. Car vlogs mo, no? Nasa grab ka na lang. Mayroon ang kuti, pero grab lang, grab. Ayoko na. Wala naman talagang madali sa umpisa. Lahat naman tayo ng drivers pinagdaanan yung ganyan. Sa una lang yan, tapos sa susunod, wala na yung chiga na lang yan. Yeah. Never give up. Never give up. Pampawala ka ba? Woo! Bye-bye! Tiyak na ako. Bye-bye! Watching! So I finally got my license. <laughs> Your girl is an official driver of the Republic of the Philippines. Talo na feeling ko totoo YouTuber na ako. Look at this setup, guys. De ba parang ganti mga international YouTuber like driving around. Di naging madale kumuha ng license, guys. Hindi na siya yung tulad ng dante na yung sinasabi ng iba na mas madali lang kumuha ng license, ganun. Ngayon, marami nang nire-require yung LTO. Madami talaga ang proseso and I didn't skip all of those. I'm, I'm proud of it because naranasan ko talaga yung pila, ilang oras ako pumila, and it was worth it. Like, the moment that I got my card, iba talaga yung feeling na parang lahat ng pagod ko that day na wala na. And hindi ako nag-fix her, guys. So, I'm driving around. Para i-flex na big girl na ako, guys. <laughs> and I'm so happy that I get to grow with you guys. And... Me moving out. Hindi lang puro apartment makeover. Yung mga susunod na episodes. I want it to be like a living alone series. Basically me figuring things out as I get old with you guys and do all these adulting stuff together. So yeah, that's about it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in our next adventure. Bye!